got a decent amount of snow here, and I don't even think the tape's all the way to the ground. Got a good little bit of snow, slushy base. Woo. We can go sledding tomorrow. Yeah. Gonna finally get to put this new DXT to work. 41 p.m. We're heading out. All right, it is currently 8:46. We are at the bank. We're gonna be pushing the drive-through lanes through here. First stop. We'll see how she goes. Hit my mirror. Reposition here. So at this bank here, I'm responsible for this little section of sidewalk, the outside door here, and the two drive-through lanes. That's about it. The city owns this parking lot that I'm in. So I don't have to uh, mess with really any of that. I'm just trying to push the snow across here to the edge. The city will come through after and make it pretty light. This person in front of us is from Texas right now, has no idea what they're doing. I feel so bad. Thankfully, I don't have to follow them for most of the here. Oof. Where are they going? 25? 25 miles an hour. Yeah. In the 60? 25 and a 60, boys. Boys and girls.
right, so we're down in Big Lake right now plowing. We started up in Princeton. It is currently around 11.30, I believe. And uh, we got way more snow down in Big Lake than we did up in Princeton. I guess there's probably four or five inches down here. Up in Princeton, we had three. Um, when we were plowing up there, we ran into some driveways that only had an inch on them, just kind of based off of the way that they were facing, I guess. Running back here. Oh, I'm still trying to get used to this boss plow. It doesn't help that I've only had it out a few times. I kind of, I don't, it's because I'm not used to it yet, but the uh, like some of the auto features the up and down and like to put it in float and stuff I'm miss tapping buttons so I'm like leaving the plow up sometimes like off the ground because I don't have it all the way down I don't know it's probably just me being stupid but I just can't seem to get used to it oh man my batteries are on zero too not in the GoPro and me. Whatever reason, I'm feeling a little bit nauseous. Got it's probably because I have a headache. Not to sound like a baby or nothing, but oof, it's tough plowing. You got a splitting headache. I'm trying to focus. I tell you what, it just this is a tough game. Like right there. I don't know why. It, you double tap it and the plow comes all the way up. It's kind of weird. I'm sure that, like, when you start off with one of these, it's probably not that hard to figure out. But for me, having experience with another plow makes it a little bit difficult. Still retraining my brain how to do everything. So at the last driveway I was on, I should have had the camera rolling. It's actually kind of like an off-camber driveway, corner, sharp, steep, up a hill. People give me crap for not plowing it with the truck. I, uh, <laughs> not really, but they're like, you should be able to plow that with a truck, or it looks like it on camera, but I tried it again tonight, and it did not go very well. Had a little bit of an off-road uh, excursion. I got up on the hill, and when I came back to around the corner, back dragon, the truck just slid down into their lawn. It was a not a good experience. Not a good experience at all.
This one was a lot of work. Even with the snow bar. Look at this. It's like six inches of snow. Five. We're plugging along here. Here, hold on. Right, so we're gonna salt. It's kind of a challenging account to plow with a truck. It's a lot tight. I'm not gonna lie. All right, so I'm gonna. We're salting and insulting. Yes, yeah, it's been a little bit of an event here. I was not a planning for this at all today. What are um, around an inch accumulation that turned into five? <laughs> an inch that turned into five, yeah. yeah. Exactly. I'm, I'm not even joking. I don't know how these guys keep their jobs. This up here was a disaster. I'm not gonna, I don't, I don't think that froze at all. Bit of uh, plowing left to do here before I finish my salting. Finally caught my second wind. Believe me, there is such a thing too. I was I was dead tired earlier. Finally started to wake up here again. This 20 minute drive will probably kick my butt though. Back up into our neck of the woods. My plan for the day here was to kind of get the priority ones done first in case I had to go home and sleep a little bit because I have worked, well, I got up for my other job at uh, 6.50 this morning, worked there for a good part of the day, and uh, yeah, I salted in there, right? I think so, yeah. Yeah, I thought so. I'm losing my mind tonight. Oh, shoot, I probably just made a mess. Oh, no. Oh, shoot. Oh. Yeah. Is it that bad? Can you see? It's too bad. I'm just going to put a little salt on her. <laughs> We're full of salt. Salt makes everything better, right? Salt makes everything better. Including it's cool. French fries. Yeah, just put a little salt Fish. on it, it's fine. All right, now I need to open this gate up. Yes. Wakey, wakey, <gasps> eggs and bakey. Oh, I'm gonna go sleep. I'm gonna go sleep. Well, what the hey? I don't know. There, there it is. Goes. There it goes. A couple left to do. I think we got... More Three. Three left? Yep. Still didn't run the full route. We had a couple that didn't need to be done. One other gravel driveway that I've done in the past, you guys have seen that if you watch my videos, up in the woods, it's pretty tight. Uh, I, I am not driving on anything but pavement tonight because this is crazy, honestly, how slippery it is and not frozen, greasy.
What do we have? Four accounts that we didn't get done or didn't do? Five. Five, I think. So we didn't do four accounts. Crazy. Yeah, no kidding, right? Yeah, what would that put us at? For a route, we, we're at seven hours right now. Oh, man. Those Maybe two nine? are those two are big. Yeah, that that would be a nine hour route. Yeah. Depending on yeah, you could say probably between eight and nine hours or eight and ten hours. And I salt it, I guess too. Probably wouldn't do that every time. But well, anyways, guys, finally got to do some plowing. I'm sorry it wasn't maybe as excited as I usually am. I guess really late. I had a long, long day. Yeah, I had some weird nausea for the, like the first time ever. I don't think it was motion sickness either. I don't know if I just had a stomach ache and a headache and the two of them combined and just didn't work out well, but I'm sure some of you have been there before and yeah, it's not the first time I've plowed sick. That's for sure. Plowed with 102 feet. Yeah, that's Ugh. COVID twice, yeah. Pretty crazy stuff. Kind of got to be a little bit tough, a little bit nuts to do this job, I think. I hope you guys are having a good, safe, productive winter. And as always, God bless. Be sure to go out, check out some more of the videos. I'll link some down below here for you. See you on the next one. Thanks for coming along with us. Thanks for coming along with us. Say like, comment, and subscribe. Like, comment, and subscribe. There you go. Give me nux. There you go.